actually, we use the medication assistance program on many occasions. Every week we need to utilize it for patients that we see here in the hospital that either can't afford their medications because they don't have insurance or they can't afford their medications because their co-pays for that medication are too high. So you can have insurance and we will help you, or if you don't have insurance, then we get them free from the pharmaceutical companies. You know, they know how much their medicine is and they don't have the copay or they're coming here and then I pay for it. They like cry, which then makes me cry. And then I'm like, let's not do this because then everybody's crying and no one's picking up medicine. I think it's overwhelming because people don't understand there is a program out there that will help them. I'm a diabetic, which I've been for 48 years and my insulin is very expensive and uh, I take four injections a day and so I tend to go through a fair amount of insulin in a, in a month's time but uh, without that I really don't know what we, we had some really difficult choices we would have had to make like uh, do you buy food or do you buy your insulin? <laughs> of course. I guess if I didn't need, I wouldn't need as much insulin. <laughs> and we're just grateful for that. There have been many changes in health care. One of them has been positive in that many people now have insurance when they've had not in the past. And although that sounds like a good thing, many of these plans still require patients to dig deep into their pockets and make difficult financial decisions when it comes to their health. Do I pay for a prescription medication or do I heat my house? That's a decision that the medication assistance program has helped many people solve and not have to choose one over the other. The program itself is so important. There are so many people that would fall through the cracks if they didn't have this available to them. We'd be seeing patients come back because of their illnesses just basically because they couldn't afford their medications and we really want to prevent that in every way possible.